we're gonna give this clam a pearl necklace. We're going on a trip in our favorite rocket ship. I'm so happy I'm a lot lizard again. Um, did you put this here? Put what? These human heads on a stake? No, no, I did not. Oh, this seems like a good place to set up camp. They call me Pistol Pete, bitch. Welcome, hoarders. Today we're going to be playing some more Gran Turismo 7. Um, right now, I gotta find a car from Japan and get 550 performance points out of it. Um, that might be a challenge. Well, the other thing is I don't want to get the cars that I'm going to win. I want to get a car that I don't already have. I see this and I like it. I know it's not Japanese. This is just like this is just what I want um, since I'm already here. I don't know if I already have the golf, but that's the exact color I like and everything. Um, I might get that today while I'm in here. And I don't remember what. Ooh. That might not be a bad one. And I like that Corvette. I like the ZR1 for some reason. Uh, I'm looking at literally every other car except for the one that I should be looking at. Um, what is this? I've never seen this before. It'd be nice to use something different. How many performance points does this start out with? 454. And I only need to hit 550. I might actually go with this. Okay, I just got the car set up. I really, really like the rims that I put on this. I don't know why they seem so good with the car. I just went with them. Uh, so let's go start the races. Um, I believe there should be three total for this. Okay, yeah, we have... These three, I believe, I'm going to check around and make sure that there's no other ones. Um, yeah, it's just these three. Okay. It appears as if, yeah, this one's nighttime. There we go. Get the hood view. That's good. Nothing that, like, distracted me with that. I should be able to finish this whole first race. I better be able to. How many laps? Three. This car doesn't have a massive amount of power. I did go a little over the 550. I think I'm closer in the 600s as far as performance points go, but a lot of my performance points went towards, like, non-power adding stuff, like weight reduction and, uh, what was the other thing that surprised me? I mean, the only thing that really kicked it up was the, uh, um, turbo. I've never really raced this at night before. Oh, I also did uh, the carbon ceramic brakes, so that probably added a lot of performance points, too. Just because it's an expensive part, um, it makes your brakes really good, which does give you better performance points, but I'm not going any faster. Come on now. Get out of my way. They're ruining my racing lines, and I don't like that. I was also debating on putting a uh, wide body kit on this, but I, I ended up not doing that. Just because it's a lot of money to not get very much 
change. I mean, if this was a drift car, I probably would have went with that. First lap, and I'm almost in fourth. Now I am. Oh, I, I messed that up bad. I, like, nosedived in the fourth place when I should have been actually paying attention. Come on now. Get out of my way. I'm gonna get held up by these guys. Until I dive through the inside like that. Is this an RX-7? Oh, I slid good there. I gotta get the RX-7 soon. If I would've really thought about it, I probably would've tried to buy one, except that's most likely under the used car category, so it would have been like luck of the draw. So I most likely would not have been able to get it anyway. Thank you for hitting me. That, that sure makes things easier. It's getting a little squirrely when I go around these turns too quick. But that's to be expected. RX-8. Can you get out of my way? Thank you. I'm not going to mess up this turn this time. I'm going to be ready. Ready like I should have been last time. I was focused way too much on passing them. Which I would like to think I would already be in first place right now if I wouldn't have focused so much on passing them. Supra. That looks like another fair lady up ahead, but the older style. Yo, are you gonna get out of my way? I'm literally pushing him. No, oh, that's a Honda. NSX. Okay, we're up front. We're good. Way too... Why do I keep turning inward? to stay in first person. And it's already daylight now. Okay, we got that one. That one was pretty easy. Um, on to the second race, then. At least this one's during the daytime, except it's raining. This might be interesting, because I do not have rain tires on. Oh, I guess it doesn't really matter, huh? Like that car. What is that? 
Nakira? Sylvia. It's another Sylvia. She rips and slides. Not such a big fan of the sliding part. I fucked that turn up bad. Looks like that uh, R32 has a wide body kit. Yeah, I really gotta slow down for this turn by hitting that. Oh no. I'm doing some dog shit stuff today, guys. Like stupid, stupid, stupid stuff. Okay. I'm I'm really doing bad. I don't know why. <clears throat> Let's stay in first. Apparently, I do a little bit better like that. This rain's fucking me up, too. I have not done many races in the rain before. Like, I do like that they finally added that in Gran Turismo 7. Like, there was maybe, like, one or two races that had different uh, different weather patterns throughout, like, all of uh, sport and, like, the rest of them. They never really implemented um, weather patterns. Definitely not like this. It's super slippery, though. I think we're gonna make up a lot right here. Once I start, here we go. I start walking them. All I have to do is get close to the car in front of me and then I think I'll be pretty good as far as overtaking them. Try not to slide here. Keep whatever speed I have. Cut him on the inside. Oh, real big slide coming out of there. And they're pushing me. Okay, fucker. <clears throat>
Now I'm getting stressed out. Because I'm going to do something stupid like that. Okay. He's still behind me. Okay, final straight. We have all the power. I don't know. I like how the front kind of looks like a Mustang. Like, the I don't know, like a 2004 Mustang. Kind of. Mostly in the grill that I put on. Hell yeah, brother. Okay. Let's see the car that we won. Motor Mania. What'd we get? Okay. We got almost the same thing that I had. Almost. It's not the same thing, but it's very similar. Okay. Now on to our last race. Okay. Well, I'm glad I didn't buy the Sylvia that you win after this, because then I would have two of them. I'm sure I'll eventually win one of these, though. Finally, a, a track more made for how I have this car set up. That was slightly annoying. I'm like, really? I got uh, soft sports tires, and we did one race at night. Well, not the night that's going to really change anything. And the other one was in the rain. I mostly just don't like nighttime races. I'm going way too fast. Well, that's okay, because we would have just probably died there. We'll still win. I am doing horrible today. Right after I was like, yeah, these tires are made more for this. Out the way. I was trying to avoid sliding there. Getting a little worried now. We don't have much that we have to make up, though. I just am uncomfortable if I'm not already in first place. Thank you for helping me break. Oh wow, it actually shows all the hood dents and stuff. This car would have been way more hurt than what it was if I actually hit that wall in real life. That would have destroyed the front of this. Oh, we only have to pass two people. And we have a whole nother lap.
there. Sneak up on the inside and then lose all my power from sliding. Okay, I think we're good. Now it's just gonna be like a leisure lap of uh, just blocking them from passing me. If I don't slide into the wall. Those straight stretches, though, let you go super fast in this. As long as I remember to hit the brakes. start breaking here. I think we're good now. <clears throat> I do think this car has great steering after how I set it up. I don't even remember really. I know I did the frequency and I, I messed with quite a few things in the uh, suspension, but I don't remember all of what they were. I think I did the dampening ratio and the frequencies and stuff. Um, I didn't adjust any of the camber or toe angle, any of that stuff. Because I figured it was probably already pretty decent. Oh, we got this. Nice little drift through there. Here we go. We got her. All three first try. I am very happy with the rims that I picked for this, though. I know I mentioned that at the very beginning, but they're, like, perfect. Daily workout. So we got to go do that, and we got to go to the cafe. I want to go to the cafe first, though see what we're going to be doing next episode as always he's going to go blah 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 I want to start the next thing <laughs> oh okay so it's a circuit one or two circuits collection Nissan sports cars completed yep I know all about them skip 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 Mm-hmm, yep, you can make drift cars out of them, yep. Uh, rally base cars. Interesting. Okay, so we have the Evo, WRX, and the Yaris. I, I know they use the Yaris for that, but I ain't a fan. The high-performance Yaris, though. Okay, so that's probably going to be three races in the next episode. For those... Let's go check our uh, tickets, see what we won. I hope it's something good. Probably won't be, though. The least amount of money, as always. Someone's going to make like a clip of me saying that every single time, because that's literally all I ever get on here. Okay.
see what yeah, one that one, one that one, one that one. That's clear. So next episode, we're going to be doing more um, Japanese cars. Um, but that is going to be it for this episode. Hope you guys enjoyed it, and I will see you in the next one. That's it. That's the spot. <laughs>